And hello there once again, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the stream. As foretold, I was going to carry on with Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening again today. Well, I kind of didn't get to it until a bit later than I was expecting, but I've still got enough time to do, I don't know, maybe an hour or so of it. Maybe we'll clear the next dungeon, maybe I'll just take this time to clue up some random odds and ends, because I think I'm at a point in the game where I can just unlock a bunch of stuff in, over, in, in the overworld. Who knows? We'll, we'll find out. We'll find out. In any case, without further ado, let us carry on. Look at that egg. I gotta go wake that thing in that egg. Crack that egg, make me a big omelette. I got all confused there for a minute. I was wondering why it was red, but I did the color dungeon last time, didn't I? Yes, yes, quite. And I gave the old lady a broom. I'm trying to remember. I think, I think I gave her the broom, and she gave me the fishing hook. And I used that fishing hook to give to the the, the guy. The fisherman, and the fisherman gave me a mermaid scale. No, he gave me a necklace, which I gave to the mermaid, which then she gave me a scale, which I think I need to put on a statue. Yes. Because everybody needs all kinds of things, and only I can find them, apparently. Also, now that I have the hook shot, I think I can do a couple more things. Like in here, for example. Maybe. Oh, well, that's not much good. No, you need to... Die. You need to die! Oh, Mr. Bond, I expect you to die! Um... So yeah, here's a neat trick that I completely forgot that I can do. Let's see if I can actually time this right. No. There we go! Yeah, bomb arrows. You can actually use bomb arrows in the game. It's great. I completely forgot you could do that. So now this hot piece it is mine! I may never find any more, but... Um, here's a question, though. How do I get out? Well, I suppose I could just do it the easy way. Boom. The easy, damaging way. Admittedly, I might have been able to clear that in a dash jump, but you knew. When is it not fun to fall in the bottomless pit? See all kinds of fun things in the pit. The pit is good. The pit is life. That's right, you sing to those animals. You soothe the savage beast. Look at how savage this rabbit is. He's seen some shit. The stories he could tell you, man. Get to the ra crap is this guy. Um let's go have a chat with Ulrira. See what he has to say. Yeah, this is Ulrira. You're starting to like music, eh? Well a frog named Mamu, who lives in the signpost maze, might know some new songs. But he charges a lot to play them. Bye! And now that I have the hookshot, I might be able to handle that. Speaking of the hookshot. What just happened? Oh, maybe there was a fairy or something. There's now no easy way to kill those things. You 
put the missing scale in the mermaid statue, because that's how things work now. It's very much like a Resident Evil puzzle, which is funny because of all the issues I was having with Resident Evil Zero this morning. Cool. You've got the magnifying lens! This will reveal many things you couldn't see before. I do believe there is a book back in the main village that, um... Wait, so the magnifying lens is just a passive thing? Interesting. It's good that I don't need to break it out like a, uh... You know, just any general item. Oh, hi, were you guys here before? If you were, I am incredibly lucky I didn't get hit. Wait, so is that the end of the chain of deals now? I guess so, I mean, I didn't get anything out of that. Um... <laughs> okay, I tell you what, let's go to the signpost maze. Although, actually, wasn't there an Armo statue or something I could... Where was that? Was that up here? I think that might have been up there. Yeah, let's try going that way and deal with that. I may have always been able to deal with that guy, but it might be easier to deal with it now that I have the bow and the hook shot. No, that's not how that works. This is how that works. So I have to go check out this frog he was talking about in the sun post maze. There are two shrines, one to the north, the other to the south. First head south, where ancient ruins speak of the windfish. You will learn much there. Mr. Owl. Thanks for all your help. At least I think this is where I had to go to fight the giant Armo statue dude. Maybe there was some other place I'm not thinking about. I think the best way to do this is just jump, jump clean over the guy. Or not. Also, no, that's not it. Or Oh, wait, no, I came down here and couldn't get in here because I needed the hook shot. Yes, I understand now. A keyhole here, it says face keyhole. Face! Okay, this must be the other shrine he was talking about. Well, really, there's not much I can do here. I do remember a shrine of some sort, like a small one that had uh, a big old Armo statue in it. Was it over there? Damn it. I am so close to dying, so suddenly. that? Is it that? I don't know, I'll have to go check that out. I need your hearts! Let me feast upon your heart! I must devour it. Yeah, there wasn't really much anything going on here, was there? Hi! 
Wanna have a chat? An artist once asked me to pose for him, and he wanted a scale, too. Can the legend of the magnifying lens be true? I don't understand how that works, though. So did he just, like, have to make a statue of you? And then get the proper scale to make the puzzle work? Is that how... Because, you know, I don't really know. I, I don't really know how that can be, exactly. Okay, so what is that? How do I get to that? Do I just uh, go this way, I guess? You leave me alone, bomb man. Be no exploding today. Oh yeah, down this way. Yes, yes, I remember now. Also, I think there was a set of stairs here somewhere. that one over there, I think. No, oh, leave me alone, statue man. Actually, if I use the shield, can't I just push them? Yeah, I can just push them on the way without getting hurt. Nice. Aha! Okay, no, this is something I already got. Nothing too exciting. Yes, this is indeed the thing I was thinking about. Alright, Mr. Statue Man! How about the Statue Man? Let's try the hook shot first. If that doesn't work, maybe the bow. Because I think I can get arrows on these pots. Yep. Well, actually, maybe I may as well just start with the bow. I think that might be a hint that that's what I need to use. No. <laughs> that's fine. That's cool. That's fine. I was never the best at defense in this game. We know this. Oh, I can hit him when he's in the air, too. It's good to know. Oh, 
Okay, that was unserviceable. You've got the face key! Oh, good, I need that to open up that dungeon, don't I? Handy. Okay. To the finder, the Isle of Koholint is but an illusion. Human, monster, sea, sky. A scene on the lid of a sleeper's eye. Awake the dreamer, and Koholint will vanish, much like a bubble on a needle. Cast away, you should know the truth. What? Illusion? The hint that everything is kind of a miss in this place. So the long and the short of it is, I need to wake the windfish, because bad things are happening. But if I wake the windfish, bad things are going to happen. Ooh. I see you have read the relief. While it does say the island is but a dream of the windfish, no one is really sure. Just as you cannot know if a chest holds treasure until you open it, so you cannot tell if this is a dream until you awaken. The only one who knows for sure is the windfish. Trust your feelings. Someday, you will know for sure. That is the thing to open up Face Cave, but I think I've got a couple other places I want to hit up first. For example, let's see if we can find the signpost maze. this frog that uh, that person was talking about, that whoever it was was talking about. I think the quickest way to do that would be to find that portal, though, wouldn't it? The one that's down by the animal village. Using those bombs. Oh well. And if I remember correctly, the portal to the animal village is just down here. It seems to be totally absorbed in Marin's song. Oh, no. Wrong way. This way. This way, yes. Tail cave. Isn't the signpost maze down here? Oh, yeah, that's it there. I just need to get in the other side of it. Meaning I have to go this way. I say nuts to you, good hopping, sir!
Okay, here we go. Let's do this thing. With my pumped up acorn music. Try again from the start. Go this way! I think the song up there would have been the start, but oh well. Oh crap. Oh wait, no, maybe this one is the start. Whatever. Apparently rereading the same sign is also against the rules. Go this way! Go this way. What a bizarre maze. Go this way. Go this way. <laughs> This way. How does one program something like this? Like, just using signs is strange. Okay, this one right here. Fall down that hole. Great, you did it! Your reward is this way. Holy shit, it's Wart. It's Wart from Mario Brothers 3. Ribbit, ribbit. I am Memo. On vocals! But I don't need to tell you that, do I? Everybody knows me. Want to hang out and listen to us jam? For 300 rupees, we'll let you listen to a previously unreleased cut! What? <laughs> do, you, do you have, like, a record label on this island? Are you wearing, like, a big-ass clock, not a medallion? Are you Flava Flavin this shit? I'll pay. It's glorious. It's wonderful. It's the singing of the angels themselves. Worth every one of my 300 rupees. Thank you, thank you very much! And now I'm going to steal this and use it for myself. You've learned the frog song of soul. It's a very moving tune. It can even liven up unliving things. What does that mean? If you play this song, you'll make everything around you feel more alive. I didn't do much for these guys. They're not all that lively looking. Let's go back to the village and read the fine print in that book. I thought I had my sword equipped. I was mistaken.
I think it was this book. Dark Secrets and Mysteries of Corland. Do you really want to read it? Sure. Round and round the passageways of the egg. I get the feeling I'm going to need to write that down. Passageways of the egg. Left, up, right, up, left, wait, left, up, right, up, left, up, right, up. Okay then. This book reeks of secrets. Also cabbage. I think all of this stuff is just random, um, game stuff. Also, because, um, I have this magnifying glass now, I guess I might need to revisit other places. Like, on the off chance that there might be something there that I had missed because I couldn't see it. I seem to recall there was a cave down here that was just simply empty, which I thought was rather strange. So maybe I should go investigate that cave. Maybe there's something in there now. As soon as I figure out where the hell it is. This one? Hi, who the hell are you? I found a good item washed up on the beach. I'll trade it to you for what you have in your B button. No. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm okay, whatever. Uh, I mean, I guess I can maybe give up the shovel. I don't really use it that much. Da -na -na -na. You got the boomerang in exchange for the item you had. <laughs> give me back the uh, boomerang, I beg you. Hey. Not now. Oh yeah, okay, whatever. Oh, see, that's kind of neat, because typically in most Zelda games, especially the older ones, the boomerang doesn't actually hurt anything. It just stuns them. I guess here it just lays waste to fools. Yeah, there was one other thing. There was an empty house in the animal village. So I don't know if something will, will appear there now. Maybe. I know I've been down here already, but... I gotta check again. No, I can't. Ow. Also this thing, what am I supposed to do with this? Will the boomerang do it? The boomerang will do it! Okay then. Boomerang, man. What more do you want? on you, fish. Aha! And that's how we got up here. Cool. I was wondering how I got up in this area. The answer is judicious use of boomerang. I forget what I did here before. Oh, that. That's what I did here before. Hey kid, you woke me up from a fine nap. Thanks a lot. But now, I'll get my revenge. Are you ready? Sure.
I'll let you carry more bombs. <laughs> Are you ready? Yeah. I deserve it. Thank you. Now look at all that junk you have to carry. <laughs> Take care. See you again. Oh no, whatever will I do? I can carry more things. Oh no, how awful. What an evil, evil bet. Speaking of bombs. see if I can find all the seashells, too. Hopefully I didn't need the shovel to find- well, I mean, if I need the shovel, I can just go back and get it from that guy who was having some severe buyer's remorse, or trader's remorse in this case, I guess. On account of him just giving me the uh, boomerang for a shovel. Pretty badass, though. Holy shit, it even killed that thing immediately. Boomerang, the strongest weapon there is! I need to come back this way to, um, head up that way anyway. Now, was it a house over this way? Was it this one? Okay. Hey, you can see me? You must have a magnifying glass. I'm not a troublemaker. I just want to live in peace. And then the mouse burges in. Hi there! It's me, the photograph photographer for 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 You say Zora is in the house? I have to take a picture of that. I'll call it I found Zora. What is that look on Link's face? If you keep me a secret, I'll tell you something useful. Go to Tarambo Shores, use the magnifying glass, and you will find someone like me. I think I just did that. Yeah, I did, I did. That's probably, yeah, the Strombo Shores, I believe. I did that ass backwards, but that's pretty nice. Of course, that's got me all paranoid, because what, what, what about all the other places I've been to that look like they were empty? Should I just go to all of them with the magnifying glass now? Also, I've got to head back north into the mountains. I can use the hook shot to get various places now, I believe. Right now, though, let's do this dungeon. And then if I have time after that dungeon, maybe I'll do that. I'll head up north and, uh... Oh, the bombs still hurt me. Head up north and see about, um, whatever is on the mountain range. With his dying breath. Oh, the boomerang even kills those things, holy shit. Boomerang's strongest weapon there is. I wonder if the implication is this the boomerang Link had with him when he shipwrecked. Level 6, Face Shrine. The Shrine of Faces. The Shrine of Face Off. Nothing but Bald Wall, Nicholas Cage, and Travolta. Wizard Robes, I presume. Okay. 
so can I kill them? I'll have to come back and investigate that later. for a lot of haphazard exploration and no idea what I'm supposed to be doing. I was going to say that's not so bad, except for- oh crap, more of his robes. I'll, um, deal with them later. giant chess pieces? And I don't have a beak for you. Okay, then. Does one kill a wizard robe, I wonder? Oh uh, well, I suppose what I need to do here is just plant a bomb. They like arrows. You like arrows. It doesn't seem to be dying. the old magic powder. That also doesn't seem to do anything. Hookshot? Unless I have to arrange them to kill each other, that's possible. Or maybe I need to find something to kill them with. Maybe they're invulnerable until I find a specific item in this dungeon. Or maybe they don't like being blown up, there's a lot of bombs. You found a beak! I think I should go have a chat with that owl statue before I do anything else. It was up that way, I believe. Of course, then again, I can't really go back, can I? Well, let's put my bombing the wizard robe theory to a test. I'd have to time it just right, wouldn't I? Yep, that'll do it. Pretty roundabout way to do it, but it's a way to do it. So let's test something else. Okay, there we go. The boomerang goes through these blocks. So let's actually go back and have a chat with the uh, fella. If 
Bubble guy. Oh. Bubble guy statue, dude. Oh. No, that's wrong. Ah, uh, just too short. How about the bow? Does that work? Yes. Of course, there's really no way I can get a proper angle on it to... Ah, uh, the hell with it. Let's just surge forward. Onwards and upwards! <laughs> Certain I'd be able to push one of those. I thought incorrectly. Hooray, compass. I like how they keep telling me about the new feature. It's a feature. It's not a bug, it's a feature. Okay then. See, these switch puzzles are going to get old really fast, aren't they? As they tend to do. So do I just need to kill the whiz robes? Done. I've only can find a room with a key in it, or a door with a keyhole, I should say. serve. Wait, there's a chest in this room down here? I probably need to kill all of those robes to get it. Of course, I can also just use bomb arrows, but, you know. There it is. No, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I don't need a bomb for a slime, that seems like overkill.
I'm fast enough, can I? Well, yes. Perfect. Now, was it over here the owl statue was? Yep. Enter the space where the eyes have walls. Mm hmm. I think that's just telling me about the puzzle I've already solved. So, you know, go owl statue. Open me out so much there, man. So much. I know how to kill the whiz robes. Too soon. Well, I might be able to get them all three of them in one go here. Yep. Triple kill! Got 50 rupees, very nice. So, does killing those with robes also allow me to get them up here? No, it does not. Let's try going back the other way then. There is a room here though. Uh, maybe I can access it over- although then again, there's no door dir directly contacting that one either. Hmm, I don't know, I'll have to check that out. Ah, uh, yes. I was wondering when I'd come across one of these. Classic floating tile trap. Nearly every Zelda game has one. Can't recall if there was one in Breath of the Wild, I don't think so. Didn't quite see how to be able to pull that off in that game anyway. Wait. Now we're good. See what the point of this room is. Wait, and I used a key to get in this room, didn't I? Then I don't understand. The one key I had, I used to get into that room. And it was filled to the brim with a hell of a lot of nothing. There must be something to do with these statues. Whatever I get in here must allow me to either push them or lift them or something. If I see my power bracelet says it has a level 1, maybe it has a level 2.
I was wondering when that was going to close. Took it long enough. Maybe I need to blow these things up. Or not. I did a whole lot of nothing. A whole heaping buttload of nothing, one would say. I wonder when the acorn thing is going to give- no wait, no, I did that too soon. I wonder when the whole acorn thing is going to give out a lot. Uh, always with the bomb. I keep forgetting. Uh, that's when it gives out. Makes sense. because this just leads me there, and that helps me not a jot. does for me. Nothing, it seems. Corners me to get hurt, more or less. Ah, hello. The, again, there are rolls. Welcome back. I'm just wandering aimlessly through the face shrine, the oddly named face shrine. That right there, I think I've got a good idea what that is. If I get over to the other side of that room, then that's gonna be one of those weird body doors. sounds out of the ordinary, so I don't know if I can actually blow up a wall. Seems unlikely. There's over here, I need to wait for this again. That's right. Just randomly attack me, you weird dolls. Da -na -na -na. Yeah, and I can't get in through there. I'm willing to bet it's got something to do with this thing. And I don't think I'll move that thing yet because I need the item for it. And this room was locked, though I don't understand why. It 
doesn't seem to be making a different noise, but let's just try bombing all these different walls anyway, just to see if they do anything. Oh wait, there you go. Huh. Well, that'll do it. Oh, hi, who the hell are you? Aren't you adorable? But now you need to die! In that just cute. But it's wrong! Although it honestly feels like I'm just playing fetch with the thing. Real violent game of fetch. Yeah, I legitimately feel kind of bad about killing that thing. It was rather adorable. It was basically a weird-looking dog, is all it was. Wait. I was a little confused there. It's like I just shunted myself into the room before it, and now I'm not, and I don't know what just happened. What is happening? Where am I? Well, just randomly exploding things work in my favor again, and let's find out. It will not. Puts me there. It puts me back in this room. And that puts me here again. This puts me here. <laughs> oh my god, shrine. Shrine, why? Oh wait. Yeah, tiles. Might as well just run it out again. Yeah, that didn't really seem to lead me anywhere, so maybe I just need to come back here. Also, the boomerang seems to be powerful enough to one-shot everything else, so what about these things? Well, I'll be goddamned. They can die. Interesting. Very interesting. So, I guess I just need to go this way again.
Oh boy, it was robes. How lovely. I'm thinking there's probably another wall I need to blow up. This place seems to be giving me a hell of a lot of bombs. Now I know I can take this... Wait. If I have the boomerang and kill the things up here, maybe the door will open? Of course, to do this now, I'm gonna need to... flick this switch again. Oh, I came up a little short. Also, thank you, Rolls. I may take you up on that offer, but for the moment, I may just muddle along and see what I can figure out. That did nothing. That did nothing. Lots of fairies, though. That's rather nice. Alternatively, I may have some idea what to do here. Crap. Okay, and now this seems very obvious in retrospect because there's a path here, and it leads between these two torches, and that's a false wall. I noticed it after the fact, but I mean, it pays to pay attention to your surroundings. This is an interesting sculpture they've got going on here. So here's a question. Does uh, lighting these torches do anything? Not really. I thought it would, but I guess not. Well, that's a big, scary, glowy thing. What the hell is that? Whatever it is, I apparently cannot kill it. Run away! Run away! Well, this kind of sucks. <sighs> I'm going to need to go back and find a switch and flick the switch. Get myself even more injured along the way. No, no, there's not one up there. I was thinking about something else. bomb for this one. Kablamo! In a moment. Kablamo! There it goes. Oh, spooky thing, you go away. Want no part of you. Do 
soon. Of course, it occurs to me I can stun them with the hookshot, can't I? Yeah, a little bit of a one-two punch, you know, that works. Oh, this puts me down here. No, I don't want the bow, I want this thing. And... You've got a more powerful bracelet! Now you can almost lift a whale! Almost, but not quite, you really shouldn't try. Than you can possibly even imagine. Okay, well, now I know how to get into that room up there, I think. Let's go check that out. Yeah, I don't really need a power thing. Wait, I thought I just need- oh wait, no, there's probably a bunch of slimes I need to kill, yes. Or maybe I do need to throw a pot at it? Why am I forgetting? <laughs> I'd say those things are probably in the way. Oh, I almost had it. No, that wasn't the point, though, was it? That was. Oh, wait, no, there's a switch. It just reset itself. A doy. Betting man, I believe there's probably a switch of some sort underneath one of these statues. Poor I, a betting man. Or maybe I just need to. Yeah, that. The statue is the switch. Bizarre puzzle. And now I'm outside for some reason. Not that I'm complaining about the additional seashell. Understand. Uh, I guess it must just be a crapshoot when it works or not. I don't know. It's very strange. It's a very odd puzzle. Okay, I think I know the next place I can go. Oh, wait. Would help if I had a sword. Not. 
More than ten tries, you say? You know, I'd believe that. So, so I don't know if you know, um, but, like, like, is there a certain way you have to throw them, or is it just a crapshoot whether it works or not? Because it probably is just a randomized thing, isn't it? just went right over his head, okay. Wait, actually... There we go! This is all about the gods of RNG, isn't it? You might be standing there forever trying to do it, or you might get it done in one try, who knows. Also, I shouldn't have destroyed that statue, I need it. This is an interesting way to lock a door, though. It's like, yeah, yeah, no, the door's locked unless somebody chucks something at it. Then, well, then it's fair game. Yes, that's right. Have at the tiles, my greatest nemesis. The tiles, the tiles of doom. There's more whiz robes. There has to be. Seems to be this place's thing. Probably too late. Nope. That didn't injure me somehow. N okay, that's odd. I guess I'm invincible when I do that. Not that I'm complaining, mind you. Double kill! this way. Oh, hi, Owl Statue. You have something new to say? Hop on top of the crystals to move forward. What? <laughs> well, that's not a crystal, that's a block. It's real nice to know I can kill these things now, though. It's, that's, uh... Boomerang, good decision. And now I'm all paranoid. I keep checking the map, thinking, it's like, is there a wall nearby? I can blow up. You know, theoretically, theoretically, you never need a door as long as you have enough explosives. Speaking of doors, now if only I can find a door, I need to use that key in. There's a block I can use that key in. Somehow.
Oh no, I think I see what I need to do here. I just need to find another one of those crystals. So, so what if I were to go backwards? Because I know if I go up, that just leads me back the way I came, but... No, there's also a stairwell. I should take that. I was doing that thing again. Oh, it's doing that thing again. So are there slimes I need to... Okay, then. A BMOS, I assume. Ah, Jesus! I gotta be quick about this. Well, quickish anyway. Go! Except this is the boss room, and I can do nothing here right now. Handy that there's a couple of those things there, though. Free fairies. Let's score. What did that just do now? Well, that just did some indeterminate thing, that's fine. Of course you're still here. Why wouldn't you be still here? Duck and weave. <laughs> to be honest, it'd probably be more beneficial to just kill the slimes, but it seems pretty hard to do, honestly. these things again. That's attempt one. This attempt two down the drain. Three. 
Or... <laughs> oh dear. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Nine. Wasn't quite ten, but we were getting there. Oh look, low rent thwomps. Then there were the rabbits. Didn't I kill these things by throwing pots at them? What do you do when there's only one pot left? Probably blow them up, I guess. Or, you know, just not use the, uh, not use the pot at all. I bet your bombs work. Yes, they do. Oh, it was more of these things. Big smiley bastards that they are. That one appears to be stuck. Oh. Ah! No! leads me over there, but I don't have the key. Meaning. Probably need to go this way first. Or rather, that way just leads me back here. How about that? I guess that's just an out in case um, I didn't have enough bombs or whatever to deal with it. to deal with you, Sparky Death Man. Oh boy. You're ecstatic, am I really? Okay. One. Oh boy, second try, not bad. Okay, now I think I should leave that like that, because then that'll... I gotta go all the way back down that way, right? Slowly but surely, I am nearly finished this. quite go that way yet because I don't have a key.
That being said... And all the way back this way, I think I might be able to do that. No, of course I have to deal with these guys again. One. I'm, I'm just going to count every time. Uh, two. Two is not bad. I can live with that. No, it wasn't actually over this way, because over this way is the freaking boss chamber, meaning I came over here for no reason. <laughs> I also need to do this foolishness again. I think it's down in the southern area, isn't it? it? Means I have to go back this way. The beauty of it, of course, is with the, um boomerang and those things floating around. I got no real worries of dying. There's that, at least. Oh, uh, yeah, more you. Oh, joy. I could have arranged this better, I think. Okay, so unless I miss my guess about what the statue was telling me... Spiky death! You found the secret medicine. You should apply this and see what... Okay. That's all well and good. How do I apply the secret medicine, then? What are they trying to tell me? I don't have any other key. No, I don't. I'm pretty sure I don't. How does one apply secret medicine? That's what I'd like to know. Oh no, thing. Hmm. 
There must be something I'm missing. At the very least, I'm pretty sure I don't have a key. Well, let's head back up that way and take a look. Maybe I do have one that I'm not aware of. As I get hit by everything under the sun. Also, seems that we got some flying bombs, just for a laugh. Let's plan some. May have already done this, but you know what the hell will it? Maybe not this way. Of course, this way just leads to the boss arena, so no, no, I don't want to go this way either, because I don't have the key yet. I don't have the bracelet, what am I doing? There. It seems like such a bizarre puzzle. On the off chance I actually do have the bloody key, which I don't think I do, but, you know. Let's just actually go over and take a look, shall we? Because wouldn't it show up here? Oh look, look what respawned. That's annoying. really all that dangerous with the mini boss it's just tedious the only danger is if you're like me you walk right into them sometimes have a key. So my question is, where the hell is the small key? I 
because I think I've killed every monster in every room at least once. The... Wait. I sort of have, but I technically haven't, because there's one room I haven't let its thing play out to completion. And that is the room that has... The second room that has the tiles, because this other room has tiles that, like, come up and just leave holes in the floor, so... Uh, I gotta find that room again. I just need to figure out what room that was. Though, of course, first I need to deal with these guys. Nearly there. I know a way to conserve resources here. So where's that room? It's not down there. <laughs> round and round he goes. Where he stops, nobody knows. Although, honestly, I think I might be over this way somewhere. Yes, this is the room. Okay. Okay, let's see if letting these things do their business actually does anything. See that color tile, man, I should have known. And then I leap into a hole. I should have known. Now I just need to remember how to get back. I think it might be this way. I swear to god, I got the memory of a goldfish. Although maybe not, because I think they did do a study at one point that proved that those things aren't really as forgetful as people say they are. In other words, I'm more forgetful than a goldfish. you things so much. Like you wouldn't believe. What even is your purpose? You just scoop around and eat. I mean, it sounds like the dream existence, really, if you think about it. Finally. Just a matter of doing this and finding my way back to the boss room, and there we are. Well, 
Why can I not open the chest? To open a treasure chest, use the pots around it. What? Okay then. Hey, you can open the door to the Nightmare's Lair. Did that do anything? I don't know. Now we just need to get down to that boss room again. Which I vaguely remember how to get to. Vaguely. That was too early. That was also too early. do this correctly. And no, it's not down that way, because that's how I got that. Oh boy. Oh wait, I need to get back to where the tunnels were, doy. Which, they were back... This way, were they not? Sure, they were. Yes, okay. And south of these guys should be this one. have this annoying room with his robe. I get the feeling I may need the bracelet for this. Maybe. We'll see. Oh, hi! Face! Hey, dummy! Need a hint? My weak point is... Whoops! There I go, talking too much again. What? I should probably stop that. Well, I guess I just weather the, uh... Oh, he's the easiest boss in the game, or at least one of them? Okay, that's good. I guess I'll just weather the, um... Barrage. Oh, 
What's with the holes? Of course, I've also been getting a lot of bombs in this place. Kind of makes sense that it would hurt a floor to blow it up. One would think. So far, this doesn't seem all that difficult. <laughs> okay, listen up. If the wind fish wakes up, everything on this island will be gone forever. And I do mean everything. Okay, so the boss doesn't exactly put up much of a fight, but he does give you one hell of an existential crisis. Maybe everything's an illusion. Maybe it was all a dream. You've got the Coral Triangle. Mountain. Something calls from the mountains. That's funny, that's where I was going to go next anyway. For a later time, though, I think that's going to be it for right now. Ah. But now, after getting turned around a little bit, that dungeon did prove to be a bit easier than some of the others. And the boss was quite the pushover, especially in comparison to, well, hell, even the very first boss, to be honest. That damn clown in the pot. There's also that. Anyway, in any case. That will be all from this and me for today. So, if you happen to stop by and join me like you yourself again, Rolls, thank you very much for that, and um, hopefully you continue to do so. When I will be able to stream next, I dunno, sometime in the coming week. Sometime in the coming week, maybe a Tuesday or a Thursday, hopefully, I'll be able to, be able to carry on with more, I don't know, Red Dead or something. If I attempt to stream Resident Evil Zero again like I did this morning, I hope the hell I don't run into the same issues I did today. And anyway, that's, that'll be a problem for later. In any case, as always, I wish you a farewell and a good night, and I will see you fine folks next time. <laughs>